this time around we got a Chevrolet. It's a C30 van. And if you can see those pretty stripes, you know it's no regular van. It's a coachman. Catalina Sport. It's an RV, y'all. And it's got problems. Pain. I I'm gonna need a real ladder. So overall, this truck is in pretty good shape. We got it the other day, drove it home. Uh, they told us when we picked it up, it had some damage in the overhead bunk from water getting in along the front roof seam. Um, I'll take you up here in a second and show you what we uncovered when I pulled all the tape off. Uh, I've got some things on order for it. I'm going in the morning to pick up some wood to Hopefully get reframing on the inside. I'll show you on the inside where we're at there at the moment. All right. So this is what the roof looks like. This is the mess that they left me on this front seam. I've got to peel all of that old silicone work out. And the worst part of that whole deal is that the skies and the weather for tomorrow are not really the most promising. So, this is the inside of the overhead bunk. As soon as it's not raining again, open that up, let everything drain out, dry out, clean up the rest of this with a little bit of insulation. And uh, there's a little bit more paneling that needs to come off of the walls so that we can put some new paneling up, build new framing for this, cut out a couple of more little pieces of old stuff here, and do a little bit more vacuuming and throwing away. 
and uh, then we'll be ready to go back in with the new frame. Also, we've got the uh, the old incandescent lighting. Is uh, they've got a lot of the covers are broken, and I haven't been able to find replacement covers for those. They love these little air fresheners. I don't know why. They're still hanging all over the place. I haven't cut them all down. But look, I've got, I ordered new lights to upgrade all of the interior lighting to these LEDs. And, uh, so we're going to be doing that. It is not hard at all to do. But we've got all these other light fixtures in here. We've got one up here. We've got one in the driver's area. And we've got a couple more back here. I mean, they all work. But like I say, they're all the 12 volt incandescent. And we're just going to go ahead while we're doing stuff. And, of course, these are going to not come on for me. Oh, wait, they've got a switch down here. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> yep. See, I mean, they all work currently. But uh, we're just going to go ahead and upgrade to the LED. And uh, we'll show you how all that's done on the next video. We are going to be back. I hope you guys stay tuned. Uh, like, share, subscribe. Let me know if you like this video. And uh, let me know if you want to see more stuff like this. Or if you want to see... Uh, go ahead. Let me have it. Let me know if you want to see the birds out there. Because, uh, yeah. I've been going. I've been looking at the birds for a while. It's great. You guys should join me sometimes. They're nice. They're peaceful. They're peaceful. It's fun. But that's a wrap for tonight. Y'all come back.